What's up everybody, it's your boy Meme here. Uh, I doxed myself uh, I, last time I tried to record this video, so now I'm recording it again because I'm not going to dox myself. Uh, turns out, if you're on an Amazon page for something, it just says your zip code. It just says your zip code on the side. I, I don't know why that's the case, uh, but okay. Um, so today, um, we actually got my battery replaced in my phone. We, got, uh, we actually went to the Apple store. Uh, in the mall, and we, you know, we saw the new iMacs, we saw the new iPad Mini, we saw the new iPhones, we saw the new, not the new, but the new M1 uh, MacBooks, and the, they're all very nice looking, they're all very interesting looking products, I wouldn't buy them, I'm not big into Apple computers, uh, but you know, the rest of their stuff is good, and so that's, uh, you know, why I like them, and also my parents forced me to get Apple products. Um, uh, and the reason why it, I'm using a tiny little 5 watt brick charger instead of the one I used to use, which is like some 40 watt fast charger or something, is because uh, I think the reason why my battery was so bad in the first place is because I was using this crazy charger. So, you know, if I just charge it barely and I charge it like five watts, um, then, you know, I'll have a really good battery for a really long time. And uh, I think that's important. Uh, so anyways, I also got this uh, salt lamp. I, I, uh, I can't really pick it up, but you can see what it looks like in the reflection of my glasses. That's how it looks. Um, yeah, so we got it at like this hippie store in the mall, uh, and it had like fountains and stuff that you can get. And uh, my parents were really into it because they're like ex hippies, right? Uh, but I ended up getting the salt lamp because I've always wanted a salt lamp, not because of the stupid negative ion stuff, okay, but because I just think they're pretty looking. And uh, my dad's doing the laundry, and so sometimes he walks into my room to give me socks. So he is thinking that was happening. Um, Anyways, so, uh, but here's the annoying thing. It has, the way you turn it on and off is on the wire, okay? And I hate that. I hate, hate, hate that. So I'm going to be spending $40 on an EVE Energy smart plug, uh, which, you know, sounds like a big waste of money, and it kind of is. But my whole opinion, right, is that I'm, I'm, I'm future-proofing, okay? Uh, because not only, now, this is when I showed the Amazon page, but it just shows your, shows your zip code. So I'm not going to do that. Um... <laughs> so basically, right, um, not only is it built on thread, but it also is a power meter. So you can see how much energy you're taking up and how much money it costs. And also you could do like an autonomous schedule thing. So you can have it turn on at night, like when it, it goes sunset. And uh, I think that's really, really, really cool. Uh, no. Okay. Um, and, uh, you know, you could also be like, hey, Siri, turn on my light and then it'll just turn on. That didn't turn off, but it would have been funny. Uh, yeah, so you know, it seems like a waste of money, but also, um, you know, I'm gonna have this object for literally the rest of my life, so you know, I might as well uh, get the best one, right? Here's something fun. Uh, you know, while we're at the mall, we all, my parents also really wanted me to get a second pair of shoes uh, because you know I already have one perfectly fine pair of shoes back there. Love them, love them to death. Right, great shoes. Uh, first time I had white shoes in a while. They're kind of gray actually, but um, you know, it's just I just love them. And uh, you know, my parents are insisting I get a second pair of shoes because their main reasoning is that if you have two pairs of shoes, then they both wear out twice as slow. So that does make sense. Um, and also, it's just good to have two pairs of shoes. Um, and you know, so we were looking around for shoes. As you could tell, we didn't buy them. Otherwise, I'd be very, I'd be showing them off. Uh, but there was this pair of shoes. It was hundred and thirty dollars, and this is why we didn't buy it. Uh, and they were very ostentatious and stupid. But I loved them because uh, I think it's funny. I think it's funny to wear stupid shoes. And uh, they were like lime green, yellowish, like a tennis ball, right? It had a squiggle, tiny little line squiggle Nike logo. You couldn't even tell it was a squiggle unless you looked really close up. Had words all over the back, all over the side, uh, talking about like specifically engineered for you know um, uh, by the top athletes in the world, you know. And on the back, it had like a weird, crazy. On the bottom, it had a crazy, weird squiggle pattern. And uh, you know, <laughs> you know, if if you look at me, you know, with my jeans and a hoodie, you know, and then you see these crazy shoes, you know. Uh, I just thought that would be funny, uh, but um, one hundred thirty dollars isn't really worth spending on a bit. Um, and also, I'd be very worried about getting them dirty, you know, let's just say I wouldn't wear them out in the rain, you know, and let's just say I wouldn't wear them very much, because I wouldn't, they're, they're an expensive object, why do you want to get them dirty if I wear them, right? <sighs> yeah, man, it seems like I love spending money, I swear I don't, it's just, uh, I care a lot about the quality of my life, 
and uh, I try to improve that as much as possible. All right, see you, dude.